My name is Chris Law. Uh, my formal background, kinesiologist. So I have a bachelor's in kinesiology from Cal State San Marcos. Everything in my life was volleyball. And so for five years, I coached volleyball for the San Diego Beach Volleyball Club. When I met Chris, he was still working at the San Diego Beach Volleyball Club. And he seemed to really love it. And um, he was really great at what he did. He created an amazing program that um, you know, is still being emulated today. But towards the end of his time there, he was starting to get really stressed. Two, three, SCB! All right, stay here, stay here, stay here, stay In March, uh, Mark and I met, and he let me know yeah. that he was going to take me out of the director role at San Diego Beach Volleyball Club. I believe it was within a month, I got a phone call from a lady, who a, a good, dear friend, who I coached her daughter, and she said, Chris, I feel like you need to at least keep doing the weekend warrior work. You know, the kids, they love the yoga, they love the training, they need this in their lives. You can't just let it go cold turkey. It was one night, I believe I was sitting at the uh, kitchen table, and Ashley was on the couch reading uh, our favorite uh, Paramahansa Yogananda's work. She mentioned how to live schools, and um, was, does it come up in the past? I'd read his work, but I never really, really thought or entertained the idea of running one. And so Circles kind of spawned from that in that moment. And Circles, this team wellness program, or what it is now, was really nothing more than just an idea of we're going to do yoga and working out, and we're going to add all the things in that we think cultivate a human being into their highest potential. We realized that there was something else. We both wanted to work in this world in a way that was we were both free to um, be ourselves. And now that's what Circles really is. Chris and I are both free to be ourselves and do that with kids and allow them to do that same thing. With volleyball, it's very clear you're teaching volleyball. Anything that you do around volleyball is basically an additive to getting beat good volleyball. But with this concept, this, this Circles Academy, there was there was no competition, nothing you're striving for in the world outside. We were going to do a program all around food, fitness, and friends. And when I say we were going to do a program around food, fitness, and friends, I'm saying we didn't really know what we were going to do, but we tried that out. And so we did. We taught food, fitness, and friends. How to eat healthy. How to eat healthy. So you feel good. You literally energize yourself with food. Fitness is, a, is an absolute constant. You must move your body. Wolf's law. You do not use it. You lose it. And then friends, or like what really at that point it was flow. And flow was a lot of things. And I say that because we didn't know what, what it was. We were looking for that third component. So, logo. It was beautiful, but seven colors is very challenging to print, so we didn't do that. And then it became something else. It became this necklace. So it started to look like this necklace. And so it. I took on these this ascending spine and these seven chakras going up the spine. We've been running circles out of our home for eight months and we get this call. Saying you have three days to shut down your little business. Now first I was pissed, angry, called my brother, showed Ashley, fired up. But it also felt a little bit like when I got asked to step down from the director role at SD Beach. There was something bigger happening. Now we're in an actual yoga studio, so in yoga, the kids are like so into it more because we're, we're there. And it's more of a um, feeling of being an actual academy because we have a professional space. Then we created another program called Yoga Teen. So as you can tell, Circles has been an umbrella and a body for bringing through this Teen Wellness Academy. And under that Teen Wellness Academy, which came through during the logo, and we meet our teens Tuesdays and Thursdays, 4 to 6 p.m. And then we, uh, we are starting Yoga Teen in the fall, uh, excuse me, in the spring and it'll, it'll run for the spring semester. So we are blessed enough to take kids on Wednesday nights from 4 to 7 through a yoga teen certification process. They'll become Yoga Alliance certified teen teachers. Bada bing!